What the hell? I looked at it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I looked at it. Oh my god. I think that just shaved one second off my lifespan. <laughs> Nothing. Never mind. Never mind indeed. Hello everyone, it's Kendall Games here, and welcome back to Soma. I, my character appears to be a bit disorientated. Oh yeah, I got attacked by a monster, that's why. But last episode, we mess up with Catherine, who is a robot. We are also a robot. Everyone's a robot, but yeah. And I pressed the wrong button. Again, it's so stupid. But where... What's that mean? I'm not smart, so I'm just, I'm just gonna, I don't know. I'm wounded. I know where there's a Let's health check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the Ark. Opinion poll. Okay. Are you excited about the Ark? At first, I couldn't really see the point of it. But then I thought, why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor of that. I think it's really important we do this. Okay. So that's the four. Okay, so another four. Is there any against? What are your thoughts on the art project? The idea is just incredible. By every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics. Beyond the superficial. I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. Okay. So that was all seems very much for this whole project. I suppose. Let's see what else. from inside the Ark? Yes. That's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. Mixed. I thought I said delicious then. Decidious forest. Urban park. Okay. That doesn't really help me. Welcome. If you're reading this, you have successfully entered the Ark. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue on this survey. How would you describe your physical condition? Oh, God. Well, things are trying to kill me. What do I answer? So this is a question for us, the player, or well, at least that's how it feels. Hmm. Well, Simon feels like, well, he still feels like a real person. He feels normal. 
I suppose. How would you describe your mental condition? I feel disconnected. A separation from the body. I feel altered. A change in character. I feel lost. I don't exist anymore. Uh, how would you describe your senses? I feel more sensitive to and aware to of my surroundings. I feel blocked. That's my senses are numb. I'm lacking one or more of my natural senses. Hmm. I mean, it's feel weird. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant. I don't like it. Something is wrong. It's disconcerting. Everything feels constructed. Depressing. I can't shake the feeling of it's all being fake. Well, that's how Simon feels. Are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? Somewhat, I feel I lost myself. Yes, I mourn my previous existence. I don't care what form I take, as long as I get to carry on. Hmm. How many questions are there on here? How do you perceive your new existence? It's a direct continuation of my previous self. Like new chapter in my life. It's like being born all over again. A complete do over. It's something completely different that has nothing to do with my future. Do you think your new existence will be a life worth living? Where even are we? So, is any of this even real? What's happening right now? I can see what Vendetta means now. He said or something, this game will sometimes make you question reality. I can kind of see where he's coming from. Eh, I don't know. Would you rather be removed from the project and, ex and accept death? Oof. Well, they're, they're not they're not sugarcoating over this. Would you be removed from the project except death? So wait, what happens? If I unplug, will Simon die? Hmm. Okay. I found a tracker homed in on the ark. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Please let it be safe. Okay, we're getting closer. here okay so it's on the planet not here is it near the old USA perhaps it's close wait hold on I just realized is it in Canada the Simon's from Canada so close Okay, we're getting colder. It's in the some. It's either somewhere in Europe or somewhere in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. At the very least, though, we now know Lambda. This is the site. It, it must still be here because this is a, this is a picture of the site. Getting closer. Here. Oh, really? There's more? How many of these scans are there?
It's here. I found it. It's at a site named Tau. Oh, no. It's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it won't make it for long in that state. A couple of decades at most. That's not much to build a future. If we got to it, could, could we get on the Ark? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. Hmm. I'll take us there. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray that Dunbat's still working. Okay, so we go to Theta. <sighs> I don't know, it's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? You know what? I found a sunken vessel just outside. Bet that could take us to Theta. Really? Didn't look completely out of action. It even lit up a little when I tried the Omni tool on it. Okay then, let's have a look. I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I'm gonna use this. So I appear to be wounded. Yeah. Where did you go? I'm wait Eating. That's trippy. Okay, so I know what she, I know what Simon's talking about. I've seen it before. I tried it, but I couldn't get it to work. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Alright, there's no more reason to be here still. Uh -oh. Cabin quarters, I never checked in here. The only room I haven't checked. Okay. There was a healing thing here, but... Ugh. I think we should get out of here now. I think it's time to leave. I've checked several else in this building. Glob, glob. Lob. Yeah, I checked this thing before, I'm, but I couldn't get it to work. I suppose where I've got to go. But there's one thing I want to check out before we do. Just because, well. There was something down this way. And I couldn't open it. I want to go see what's there. Because will that thing, that ship back there, take us to the surface? I wonder how deep down we can. What is that? Okay. There's something there. Catherine said don't look at it. Is, it, is this basically blocking my way right now? Okay. 
Okay, it's, it's gone. Let's just take it slow. There's the door. Let's hope this thing works, otherwise this was a big waste of my time and my sanity. It... Right. So this was for no reason. Love that. Absolutely love that. need to watch out for that thing. I'm just going to take it slow. I'm going to keep the light off. Because running in horror games is never a good idea. The amount of similarities between this and Alien Isolation are uncanny. I will say... I guess we're going to the surface. Okay, I think we're safe now. What you're for. But it ha the option has to be here. Right. Okay, it works. Uh, Good. How, what? What is this? Curie Emergency Vessel 4. Hey, Simon, can you hear me? I hear you. Can you get this thing running? Hang on, I'll give it a try. I thought you should have to try and open that door. Sorry, it's dead. Worth a shot? The CV came from Curie. It was a ship that used to make runs between Lambda and Lisbon. Looks like their wreck is close. Maybe you can find a vessel like this one inside. Sounds like a plan. I'll just save the security information and update the Omni tool. There. Should help you get around. Great. How oh, great. I guess where, guess where we have probably have to go. Back where we just were. How awesome is that? I can almost bet you now that we will be able to go there 100% surely and not get attacked by something on the way. Can you detect my sarcasm? <laughs> oh my god. What the hell? Okay. Like, it's got to be here, right? This is the only door I haven't been to. It's locked. What was that? I can hear sounds. Ugh. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Okay, I swear, please, just open the door. I don't want to be in here anymore. Finally! But as annoying as this is, as happy as I am to be out inside now, I bet it's not going to be any more fun in here. Oh. This makes me think. This reminds me of the Mercury. The Mercury 2 from Subnautica Below Zero. The amount of things I see in this thing is uncanny. I didn't like that ship either, and I don't like it here. Whatever this is, it's been down here a long time. Climb up there, I suppose. in here. 
that's not good. That means it's close. Whenever my light starts flickering, that means it's close, doesn't it? It's like that thing from Monstrum. Which which one of those creatures was it? I remember any time the electric started not working properly, that meant the creature was close. That was usually your only warning. Before something terrible happened to you. Forwards. Something's wrong. Something is wrong. Something is very, very wrong. Oh! What the hell? I looked at it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I looked at it. Oh my god. I think that just shaved one second off my lifespan. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, 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 it's just a fish. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Whew. I can see glowing lights in the distance. This is so much fun. Where's that thing? So far it's just content with just scaring the shit out of me. Simulation overload. I don't know where to go. Which way do I go? There are two different ways to go. I feel so safe. This light does nothing. Man, this is so creepy. This is so creepy. I... I... Ugh. I can't go that way. It's got to be in there somewhere, right? I see a ladder. At least... Is that a ladder? No. It's not a ladder. Glowing red light. What do? Oh god, what was that? I, I got scared by something. Oh, so stupid. Man, I'm so on edge right now. There's something... Oh. An emergency light. It was just an emergency light. Why is that still working and nothing else is, though? Oh, it just makes me think back to a freaking Top Gear reference of all things. Oh, that stupid joke light you have on is still working. Is that less than funny now? Yes, the one thing I don't need is still working. Okay, so that's locked. Just the only way is up. I've got to go this way because uh, the catwalk is destroyed the other way. Did I tell you how safe I said I feel by now? This. Come on, 
open. Don't. Okay, so I'm trapped in here. Um, hello? Hello? Wait, wait, okay. Alright, we're in. Let's find a working escape vessel. Find a working escape vessel. Okay. I think as it stands, though, I think I'm gonna call it here. Because, yeah, I think I've had enough uh, jump scares for one day. But, well, I suppose without saying too much more, this has been Ken Dog Games. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one.